Thank you, Madam President. Friends, today I rise to remember one of Detroit's finest. It's during these dark times that you'll often hear me or one of my colleagues uh, bring up the spirit of Detroit. Uh, and it's at that same time we do for this latest fallen hero. We have such brave public servants who protect our city and like Officer Doss, who embody the spirit of Detroit. But what exactly is the spirit of Detroit? If you've ever been to our great city, as many of you have been, uh, many of you grew up in, I implore you to visit the monument. It's a larger-than-life landmark that represents the city and those who love it across our great state. On the wall behind the sculpture is a verse from 2 Corinthians, chapter 3, verse 17, that reads, Now the Lord is that spirit, and where the spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. Think about that for a second. Where the spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. The plaque on the front of the monument reads, the artist expresses the concept that God, through the spirit of man, is manifested in the family, the noblest human relationship. When taken together, everything that the spirit of Detroit represents is seen through Officer Doss in each of his 25 years. His father was a police officer. And while Glenn could have gone anywhere in the world, he chose to stay home and protect the citizens in the city that he loves. His family said he chose a career in law enforcement because he wanted to serve the community he grew up in. There were ups and downs on the job, no doubt, and certainly it came with its own set of risks. But the one thing that remained the same was his commitment to the people in his life, his family, his girlfriend of nine years, his son of nine months, and his brother, Blue, who had worked alongside him just two short years ago. And of course, Detroiters. Glenn passed away two days ago on Sunday, and at the age of 25, as a result of the gunshot wounds he suffered while protecting those very same residents that he pledged to protect and serve. We lost a wonderful spirit that day. Wherever Glenn was, so too was Liberty. Wherever Glenn was, so too was his family, his brothers and sisters in law enforcement on the Detroit Police Department. Wherever Glenn was, so too was the spirit of Detroit. It is up to us to make sure that we live our lives in a way that will honor his memory and continue to forge along the path that he paved, building better communities, creating safer neighborhoods, and just being kind to one another. Officer Glenn Doss Jr.'s dedication to Detroit will never be forgotten. Just like the spirit of Detroit, he will live on through each and every one of us and across our state of Michigan, through his brothers and sisters in law enforcement community. Just like the spirit of Detroit, I believe that our city and our state can rise again through strong support of law enforcement and those who live their lives to protect and serve. I'd like to ask for a moment of silence and that my remarks be printed in the journal. Thank you, Madam President. Will senators, staff, and guests in the gallery please rise for a moment of silence to honor Officer Doss. <laughs> 